Imagine you're climbing a very tall mountain. At every step, it becomes harder and harder to breathe. This is because, as you hike up, there is less oxygen available in the air. This is what fish feel in deoxygenated water. Deoxygenation is the loss of oxygen available in the water, which can occur throughout the ocean. This happens when there is an imbalance of nutrients and the food chain is disrupted. Like trees, in the ocean there are plants that make oxygen called phytoplankton, and like us, fish need oxygen to breathe. But with less oxygen available, the fish feel like they're climbing a mountain. Humans can make this trek even harder for the fish. Nutrients from agricultural and industrial runoff can lead to an imbalance in the food web. These nutrients feed phytoplankton, which are consumed by microorganisms that breathe oxygen and remove it from the water, leaving less for the fish. Eventually, deoxygenation causes the fish to either swim away or die. This worsens as the ocean gets warmer and human populations increase. As more fish die or leave the area, less fish can be caught by fishermen. With over 3 billion people relying on fish for 20% of their protein intake, this becomes a major economic issue globally. While the future may look gloomy, some deoxygenated areas have recovered as a result of cooperation between communities. This creates a healthier ocean where fish can breathe easily.